Yes, I found my people. No way. Whoa, easy there. I'm gonna use. Yo, what's going on guys? Riot's here and welcome to Animalia. The game finally complete enough to be released on Steam with a bunch of updates. Leave a like on the video if you guys want to see more of this stuff or if you just love animals. Animal simulators are the freaking best thing ever, but they're usually very hard to do and usually rushed and not perfected and honestly they require so much love and attentiveness, so I never have 100% faith going in. Also, hit the little notifications thing down below because I went like two weeks without posting a video and my channel almost completely disappeared. It was crazy. All right, so going into this, looks like we still have the little leopard. We have a baby lion. So you start out as a baby necessarily. Oh my God, a baby gazelle. That's the cutest damn thing I've ever seen. Well, never mind. Baby rhino is actually the cutest thing I've never seen next to baby bottlenose dolphin and baby hippo. So I'm just going to go ahead and... Oh, cool. Okay, so you get to obviously mess with his details a bit. Not like anything changes that much though, it stays in the realm of possibility. Minor attributes, if you will. Alright, there's various spawn points as well. So far it just kind of seems like the aisle, but with dinosaurs. I mean, <laughs> you know what I mean, damn it. Alright, well at first glance, I freaking love this. I don't really know what hippos look like. Damn it, rhinos! But I have like the, the tattoo. I have a tattoo on my ankle of, of Ace Ventura inside a mechanical rhino. So I'm, I'm slightly familiar with what they look like. All right, I sort of love this like freaking crazy. There's like absolutely nothing around me or to do, but that's realism, baby. That's like the African plains. And I'm just a baby rhino who's most likely completely screwed because kids need mothers. Oh my God, look at that running animation though. That's the cutest damn thing ever. That is unbelievable right there. This is next generation gaming. I don't care about any other aspect of this game. Oh, look at it, just kind of skip it around because they do run like that. They run like goofy little mysterious turns. All right, so we have a left click. That's like our attack. We have a little right. Okay, so it looks like that one's kind of, I'm not really necessarily sure. It's hard to visualize it. I imagine as an adult, maybe that'll do something. And that's pretty much all we're able to do because to do, the game is super early access. I'm just going to give the developers the benefit of the doubt and assume that they are going to update it a bunch more. But currently, this is all the content in the game. So, like, be wary, purchasers. Okay, we get to grow, I assume, when that hits a certain spot. So, it's pretty much just, like, existing. Unfortunately, it doesn't look like I get to reset my spawns and go to another spot. Like, on the server, I'm stuck as this thing until I die. I don't see any water or anything for a while, dude. I have little to no back information on how to survive the African tundra. I, how do they even find water, for God's sakes? Okay, here we are in a totally nude area. See, this is what I'm concerned about. I am, I, I, my, my information on, my, my, my graphical knowledge on Africa is very limited. I, wherever freaking George of the Jungle was filmed, there's plenty of water there. But then wherever other parts are filmed, it's usually based around one watering hole. I think all of my African knowledge is mostly based on Disney movies. So you can see the issue here. There's a, there's a big gap in knowledge. Okay, that looks like a something though. A rock? This baby rhino is gonna- Holy shit, first person is insane. Oh my god, I was not ready for first person baby rhino gameplay. This is what they see? Those poor creatures. <laughs> this looks like I'm sprinting for my life completely belligerent. Oh my god, oh my god. It's- it's lions. <laughs> That's- it's lions and a corpse. Is what's uh- is what's going on here. <laughs> That was the cutest little noise ever. Okay. I wonder if they'll just let me walk away. Now that I notice what they are. Yeah. I was going to go in and inspect a little, a little bit, but... My only thing that might keep me alive is the fact that I'm a child. Oh, wait. Never mind. Look. Missy Miss. Admin. This rhino is way too close. Okay. I don't like that. So, whoa. <laughs> what a great way to make me have to come closer. <laughs> uh oh. Oh, God. You can attack him at that point. It's so lonely, poor thing. <laughs> okay, yeah, I see it. Missy Miss right there is a cub lion. With like her mother right there. Send love to Mr. Rhino. Okay, oof, no parents. I'm getting slammed in the chat right now. Also, that's the cutest freaking noise. There's no way that's not like a... That's like an anime sound effect. That's not how baby rhinos sound. If you leave a like on the video right now, we'll attack that baby. Come on, do it. By now you're realizing leaving a like on the video does not notify me because it's time travel doesn't work that way, but I might just do it anyways. I've grown bigger for sure. If I just get a little bigger, can I just massacre these people? I'm becoming an adult. An adult rhino will freaking mangle. Oh no. But we do have peanut brains. <laughs> Gotta watch out for the peanut brain. 
If you can't shoot the rhino or any other animal, then move yourself. It's a realism server, and in real life, you're not seen as a threat, then a rhino would chase you away and even kill you. Oh my gosh, hello realisms. I am a rhino. I could kill them. I must test the nature. All right, I'm going for it. Clearly, I feel bad about it. I love animals. I don't even like, I don't want, I'm, I'm, firstly, I'd like us all to freaking just, all right, you know what? I'm just not going to kill anybody. Let's just go in here and see how these guys react first. Clearly, this is a very intense situation. They're eating that body. Who was that zebra? Did he have kids? Uh-oh. What are these things down below in the corner? Let's go. Oh, they just finished off the corpse. Good time right there. Good timing. They have a little good... Dude, this thing is tiny. I can freaking vaporize this thing. I'm pretty sure I can kill the crap out of both of them, in fact. They're pulling pieces of meat off of it. It's pretty crazy. Who's going to strike first? I'm such a I'm such a freaking nice guy until I'm bullied or antagonized, and then but they have to make me be evil. They have to do something. For, whoa, what was that? Okay, clearly the game has a little bit of bugs. <laughs> so, it's early development. All of other faces get all bloody because they're eating the gazelle. That's actually crazy right there. Like that's that's super cool looking. Their animations look pretty cool too. The blood coming off. I love all of it. I feel so, I, I want to crush them, but I, <laughs> I just need them to give me a reason. I'm like a police officer. Give me a reason, punk. Honestly, that's going to be the coolest place for lions to ever exist. Inside there, that's like so awesome. And then they just like go outside and hunt creatures and stuff. The servers are pretty empty because the game is brand new. You will notice that if you're downloaded. It's super hard to keep new games populated though. Like it's actually one of the hardest things ever is building a game's fan base. But honestly, this is super cute. I think if they just keep up this kind of stuff, it'll build up for sure. Because people love animals. I love animals more than anything. Dude, this is like the most, like, Lion King crap I've ever seen. That's like Pride Rock. This is where the lions live. That's where they address the kingdom. I can't get over the politics of this place. I'm so happy I didn't kill that baby right there. <laughs> I'm sure so many people would have wanted me to do it, but I need to wait till they attack me. I don't want to just come on a server and crap on it. It's a realism server. I'm pretty sure baby rhinos are generally pretty nice. I think even the adults necessarily need to be antagonized. I've seen videos of an adult hippo attacking a rhino, and the rhino didn't even care. Because they have their, <laughs> they're, they're just big tanks. So are hippos, in all fairness, but the hippo wasn't that pissed. Dude, there's no water in the salt. It's gotta be in there. The water's gotta be in there. It's like Mad Max rules. Mad Max freaking Fury Road. It's just desert. And then wherever there's trees, there's water. Except there's clearly not over there. But there's so much tundra and brush in there that there's gotta be a source of water. I'm just a curious little rhino, in the words of the great Ace Ventura. I love how we really have nothing to worry about around here. Like, those things, it have to be literally a pride of lions to take us down or something. Or a bunch of hyenas, but those aren't even in the game yet. So, I literally have nothing to We have, like, free roam of everything. I wish I could be an elephant, bro. Elephants will be in this. I've seen them already. They, they were in, like, the testing, and they look so cool. I assume they're just working on baby elephants first. Is that a dead zebra? Water! Oh my god, I found the source of life. Look at him down there, drinking his stuff. Sort of looks like he's just drowning himself, actually. Hang on. <laughs> it's not worth it, little buddy. It is, he's just holding his face underwater. Okay, but it builds up. All right. <laughs> I've had enough of this world, of the politics, of the rat race. I want to throw it all in. Oh my god, did you see its little legs kick for dear life as it was falling? That was the saddest thing I've ever <laughs> seen in my life. All right, here we go. Time to come in as uh, what I can only imagine something that will be mass stocked by any carnivore on the server, which sounds freaking awesome. Okay, so one thing, this is the cutest thing I've ever seen, running through the tall grass for like a tiny little food. It's, it's, it's super cute. But on the other side, this, this map is infinitely bigger than I initially thought. Like the amount of range you can spawn across is absolutely insane. There's a chance if I'm just this small, I'll just never see anybody again. Is that a black lagoon? That's the most terrifying thing ever. Once, like, crocodilians are added, that's gonna be some nightmare stuff. I love these noises. Really getting into them. I think gazelle is my spirit animal. I mean, this isn't easy biome. The biomes are, like, ranged by medium, easy, and difficult, so it's like, I assume easy will have splinterful amounts of water. Oh my god, we're so little. Ow, oh, plops his head down for some water. Wow, without like parrot gazelles, being a gazelle just sucks. But I imagine once you're, because they gotta be like the fastest things in the game, right? At least barely, maybe like the most stamina. I like that. If you ever want to spawn somewhere else, you could always just drown yourself. Whoa, it's so creepy down here. It's gonna be beautiful down here once we get to play as a crocodilian hunting underneath the lily pads. 
Okay, so this is what I really like. Hey, you could be a lion or a leopard. I feel like leopard is the stress. I mean lion. I mean definitely is what I meant to say is lion. Oh, you could be a white lion too. That's crazy. Really increase your chances of getting poached. That's fantastic. All right, let's see what a very hard biome looks like as a baby lion. That's what? I was in a very hard biome. Why would I spawn here as a baby rhino? Suicide. All right, so this is awesome right here. I love this. Ooh. Oh, these noises. What is that? That was the best one. I forgot how horrifying first person was. I'm going to test it and out as the others. This is crazy drunk vision, bro. Can I see my paws? Where's my paws? Oh, there they are. There's those paws. <laughs> it's just... Well, it looks kind of derpy. Once you see that we're just a lion looking at our feet. I suppose I can eat that dead zebra just because I'm getting hungry extremely fast and I don't know where any of these people are on this giant server. Wait, is this not even an option? I just assumed I could get to it, but now I'm thinking I can't even get to it. Yeah, now I'm seeing that that might be a bit of an issue. Oh, this just sucks. Okay, now we're in survival mode. See, I feel like generally, is there like a lay down button? There's always a lay down button. Where is it? Those guys were, okay, there it is. Is that a sit down? That's super cute. Look at the size of those paws. We're gonna grow into them one day. I don't quite know all the buttons just yet. Holy crap, is that night vision? Wow, that would help insane. Just not, That's what I should do. Okay, no, we are laying down. It's just like super slow motion, but that's right there. I was wondering if like we have any kind of attributes that help us hunt. There it is. All right, buddy, stand up. Whoa! This dude looks just like Simba. I can't get over it. For some, for some reason, though, we seem to be moving in slow motion. I don't understand it. Hang on. Are we stuck in permanent slow motion now? It's a weird thing to just accidentally happen out of, no out of nowhere right there. I can say in all my years of gaming, this has never happened to me on a multiplayer server before. Dude, I'm going back to the baby rhino. Life has just been pure doo-doo butter since I left the baby rhino. I should have never left. Wait a second. Why do rhinos have night vision also? Night vision just lost all point. <laughs> Hang on a second. I believe like it should be a purely like lion or... I don't know, hunter's thing? I, 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 I need to research rhino eyeballs more, but I'm pretty sure this should be pretty specific to carnivores, perhaps. Going to go hunting. Yeah, I'm in. All right. It's all right, baby. Now we just gotta become a full-grown adult in five seconds. Okay, see a baby rhino? It sees a bunch of rocks in the distance? That's what we'd see necessarily, but a baby rhino would see a bunch of sleeping mothers. Perhaps one of those rocks has to be my mother. She's just sleeping. She's gotta be over there. Poor little dude would probably go up into each individual rock, nudging it, seeing if it's his mother. Like a turtle, when they try and bang all the boulders in the distance, or in the area, or tortoise, thinking it's another tortoise. Tortoise is trying to bang rocks, dude. Oh my god, it looks like the land descends a little bit right here. Could that mean that there's water? That would be the coolest thing ever, because I have no freaking idea where to find this stuff around here. I'm still not sure what I'm supposed to eat either. It's very confusing. It would be very helpful to have a parent. Whoa, pump the brakes! What's going on down there? It's like a whole little world, man. I think I see a corpse down there. I do. I think I see a couple little red specks, which indicate there was stuff hunted down there. I feel like this is lion territory. This server is actually called, like, the Lion Pride or something. So I'm pretty, uh, I'm pretty sure that's where they make their home. Wait, another baby. There's a little baby gazelle. Hang on. My only chance at a friend. I'm not giving up on this. There are so little chances for friendship in the animal kingdom. Especially when there's like the last five animals on earth for the love of God. I feel like this server might need to initiate some artificial intelligence at some point. Like some AI creatures. Kind of like how the Isle eventually did after we all got like sick of wandering around for hours lost for years. <gasps> what the sh- Oh my god. That lion, is, that lion sounded so much closer than it is, but it's actually pretty close. And it looks like it's coming over here. I may have a serious issue on my hand. Hang on, I'm gonna try and... Oh, he's not so close! Why did they make him sound so close even though he's kind of far away? Where'd he go? I feel like I'm pretty concealed right here. He's looking for me. But is he gonna find me? He's right there. Look at him over there. I'll bet if I make a noise, it'd be so loud for him as well. What you gonna do, little buddy? Where'd that noise come from, huh? <laughs> that was stupid. I should have stayed hidden. Okay, this guy looks downright hungry. I feel like he's gonna find me, right? There's no way he's not. <sighs> oh, walked right past me, you dingleberry. That's why you are alone away from your pride. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Hang on, nope. Hang on. He's, he's, he's close to figuring it out. We got us a weird little game of Marco Polo going on right now. He's so close. How does he not see me? It's because I didn't move. 
I've mastered the art of holding perfectly still. He knows he's close. He's got blood on his face. He clearly just came from killing something. Yeah, there's no chance I'm gonna see you know I'm like right here. I gotta be right here, right? But where am I? I feel like where I am is so obvious. <laughs> I'm not, I'm not actually that hidden. Oh, he's shaking under the rocks, oh God. Oh crap. Oh, he checked under one rock and then gave up. That's what you get for being a quitter. You go home without food. Oh my God, your wife's gonna leave you. All right, I've stalked their pride. I lost that guy. I've stalked their pride noises for like half an hour now. I'm pretty sure I've located where the family lives. My plan for slaughter is almost complete. This baby lion is about to take out, I mean, this baby rhino is about to take out a whole pride of lions. It's gonna be a, a, a biblical. There's actually water all over this place. This map is something so done well. Like this map is, a good map is a really important part of an animal simulator open world game. And this one is perfect, dude. There's like, oh my God, I keep hearing them. Okay, I'm getting closer to the lions. They, they live through such a vast range of mountains and valleys and past so many like beautiful ecosystems. Oh, okay, I was, okay, so it's a dead, okay. I thought it was a boulder with a stick sticking out of it, but it's clearly a giant dead creature. It's a dead elephant. And it's stuck making elephant noises. Do you have any idea how far I've gone to find you? <laughs> and it's, it's not even real. It's been an illusion this whole goddamn time. I'm losing my mind around here. Or is there lions over here that just killed it? Hang on. Man, this looks incredible though. This looks so sad. Innocence, innocence lost. Baby rhino finds. This, this elephant was a friend of my mother. There was a lion past it. What I'm going to do is hide inside this body. <laughs> genius, dude. Next level super genius. Yeah, that's like clearly where all the lions live. That's a super cool area to hold up in right there. There's so many amazing base locations. This is actually really fun. I've been kind of just like watching these people planning my attack. If I was like actually a group of, of, of rhinos and we had a systematic attack planned on these people, this would be the craziest war right here. Just like in the middle of the African plains, just species versus species. But instead, we just have a baby hiding in the corpse of an elephant. Oh, yes! That other rhino's rising up. Oh my god, <laughs> yes. Viva la resistance. He's chasing that little fart all over the place. That's what I'm talking about, baby. Oh my god, he makes me so proud to be a rhino. Oh my god, it's a full-on rhino invasion. Exactly what I said is happening is happening. <laughs> that's, that's crazy. Yes, I found my people. No way. Whoa, easy there. I'm gonna use. It's not like I'll make my cute little rhino noise. Yes, I was hiding here. I was hiding from the lions for days, brothers. It was intense. Now I just get to be the child, the responsibility-less child who just gets to run around and be a little goober. I have no responsibilities. <laughs> this, is, this is awesome. I can't believe my people came in from the mountainside and just completely, completely eliminated the competition. This game actually has so much potential for like fun, amazing adventures. Plus, I really cannot get over how beautiful the map is. Look at every little blade of grass sways across like entire oceans of beauty. And just like that, their beautiful pride rock that was intended for lion domination has been conquered by the rhinos. Oh, do those rocks look like giant wieners to you guys? Oh my god. What do we got going on over here, huh, punk? Is this a dead one? It is. Something horrible happened to this guy. Whoa, when you go in the wall, your feet fold back. Our new house is so lovely, dude. And rhinos control this area. It's about time that we get some freaking respect around here. There's my broskies just patrolling the area for many lions that might come back and bring the hostile intentions. I love this, dude. I'm so, uh, even though I'm a baby, it obviously takes a long time to grow up before I can actually do anything and contribute in battle. It's so fun to see it from like a baby's perspective. If you guys want to see more of this game, I'd love to freaking play it. Maybe get a bunch of subscribers into the server and we make like a giant animal war. That sounds so cool. So if you guys want to see more, Leave a like on the video, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace!